There are 10 different X Factor receivers in Madden 23, and today we'll be scoring a touchdown with every single one of them. Each touchdown we score will come with its own unique challenge, starting with Terry McLaurin, who has ankle breaker. So of course we'll have to score after faking out at least one defender. Gotta get here. Ah, we didn't really fake anyone out. Let's try again. We'll try a slant route here. Hit him there. Hit him there. Crap, we couldn't fake him out again. I'm going to throw the ball here. He's going to hit it. Going to make that guy miss. Precision juke. Makes that guy miss. Go, Terry! Let's go! We made not one, but two guys miss. With Rack'em Up, we actually have three receivers. Starting with Stefan Diggs, and our first challenge is to catch a slant route for a touchdown using the Rack feature. Hopefully, he gets open on the slant route, and we can throw a touchdown using the Rack feature. And we do! First Rack'em Up challenge completed. Also, with Rack'em Up, we have Cooper Cup, where we're going to try to score with a Rack catch on a post route. We're going to just try to throw this right there. Rack it. We didn't. Thankfully, we still got him in the zone here. We're just going to try to throw this again, and... We're going to throw a pick. The reason why I say thankfully we had him in the zone is because once he goes out of the zone, we have to complete five 20 plus yard passes to get him back in the zone. God, dude. which as you can see is just extremely frustrating. Oh my God, dude. Keep throwing pick sixes. It was not an easy thing to get him back in the zone, but we finally did. We've got Cooper Cup on a deep post route here, hoping we can hit him over the top. That's kind of my objective here. Oh, I think we've got him. Rack him up, baby. Rack him up, baby. Come on, Cooper Cup. Let's go. Our last wide receiver with Rack him up is Tyreek Hill, where we're trying to score with a rack catch on a streak route. We're just going to try to get as much blocking as we can. Throw it up with Tua. We got the rack. Oh, my God. Unfortunately, he tipped it out. Oh, we might have him. We might have him. We might have him. We might have him. Nope. It got swatted out. Anytime we throw an incompletion, Tyreek gets knocked out of the zone. And since he doesn't have double me, like will help us big time later on in the video, it could be really tough to actually get a rat catch. I've really, really struggled with this. So we're just going to try to launch it up and win on rack. Somehow it gets tipped out until finally. Yes, Tyreek, rack, touchdown. Oh my God, we finally got it. That took me so long. Next, we have max security with Keenan Allen. Well, we'll have to score any touchdown with any route, but we'll have to do it with a possession. Catch. Gotta make six consecutive catches here with Keenan Allen. And the easy way to do this is just by throwing a bunch of drag routes. With Keenan Allen in the zone here, we still got a lot of field to work with. We have to make sure we don't get him out of the zone. So I'm just gonna start there. That's a perfect example. We just need to do that in the end zone. And on this seam streak, it looks like we've got a perfect opportunity, but oh, we scored there, but it wasn't on a possession catch. It was on an aggressive catch. So we gotta try again. We've got him on this crossing route here with these X Factor activated. Can we get a possession catch for a touchdown? That's it, dude. That's it. Possession catch, max security, challenge complete. Debo Samuel has his own X Factor with Yakima, and we're going to have to score a touchdown after breaking at least one tackle. The criteria to get all these players in the zone is pretty similar. Just 20 plus yard catches, and you have to get three to five of them. It ranges. Want to try the bubble again? See if this can work for Debo here. First and goal. We're going to th throw this ball. He's got to break that tackle. He does break the tackle. He can't break another one, though. You can only expect so much. Same thing here. Debo on the bubble. We're going to fire it. He's going to break that tackle and he gets in you saw him break the first one and we completed that challenge and we have four receivers with double me where we're gonna move the ball back making it a more difficult touchdown every single time starting with dk metcalf we've got dk on a goal line fade we've just got to catch a touchdown here so i'm gonna try to high ball it with double me Double me, double me, almost. Oh, DK's knocked out of the zone now. Are you kidding me? And if you couldn't tell, getting players back in the zone is an absolute pain. Take number two, DK is in the zone. Goal line fade, here we come. Come on, put it on the money. Put it on the money. I don't understand how we don't add catch him there. Attempt number three, DK Metcalf in the zone. Please, buddy, we gotta have you catch this. We gotta have you catch this. He got it! Touchdown! Goal line fade objective completed. Next is Justin Jefferson, where we'll have to use double me to score from the 10-yard line. Come on, we gotta get this, man. We gotta get this. Double me! Double me! No, we dropped it! How does he drop that? Let's give it a take number two here. We're gonna throw the high, Paul. Come on! Double me! Let's go! Player number two is complete on to player number three. And now we have Devontae Adams, where we'll have to score using double me from the 30-yard line. Let's hope Derek Carr can put it on the money. I really hope he can. I'm just gonna throw it up. Devontae Adams, double me, brings it down first try. Last but not least, we have Mike Evans, where we'll have to score using double me from the 50-yard line. Every time we fail, I have to take a drink of this lemon juice, which is just gonna be disgusting. We're on the 50-yard line, and I don't wanna take any of that lemon juice, so let's hope we get the time in the pocket, first of all. 
Oh my god, he's wide open. Double me! But we didn't score the touchdown. Oh, we gotta try again. Oh, man. Oh, I can... Oh. oh my god, it's so, it's, so, it's so strong. Holy crap. Wow, that was... Horrible. Absolutely horrible. Now they're in cover three deep. I think that's gonna hurt our chances here. Get the time in the pocket. Launch it up, Brady. There's two people on him, so I don't think it's gonna activate. Holy cow, it worked! Look at this challenge complete. And I also did this with quarterbacks if you wanna see that video. Click up here.